We just happened to stumble up on an accident over here. Let's uh, check it out and see if everybody's okay and if the police has been called. I don't see anyone injured. Is this guy leaving the scene? Not sure if this person was involved. Is everybody okay? I avoided being hit. I'm headed to the cancer center. But I was coming down here and got right under there. That car was to the side of me. Is that your car, the blue car? No, that one came off the ramp. It oh. turned. Where's your car? It's over there, the floor. Oh, oh, but you didn't get hit. No, I was in the oh. left-hand lane. And this guy was to the side of me, so but who, a little bit back. Was this truck involved in the accident? Too? No, he was not. Oh, what are they doing? Blocking, I guess. Oh. Okay. They, they came off the ramp. We're turning at the... Holy cow, what are they doing? They're coming at us. So did the blue car hit the white car? Or? No, they admit, this just happened like seven minutes. And so I'm to the side, and I'm on this lane. I'm getting ready to turn in this left-hand lane. I'm always very observant. And I looked, and I thought, holy cow, he's coming at me. So I pulled in this lane and gunned it. And wow. I saw him, and he was smoking. Do you need a name? So, so. Do <laughs> you need a name? I was the car to the left of you as you got hit. So who was at fault? He was. Where, 100%. It, is there somebody in that car right now? I don't know. Oh, it's probably that dude there, huh? I don't know whose car is who. I can't see it. You just videotaping this for fun? I, I have a media company, and I just, I, no. I, I like to take pictures in public. And, yeah. Uh, I, I go into, uh, well, I'll tell you. You're, I go to the Trump rally. You're, you're being very cordial, very nice. Yeah. So I'll, I'll tell you exactly what I'm doing. If you were any other way, I would probably just ignore you, but I'm a... Uh, I was a media. I was radio and television. Oh, broadcast. cool. Major. So I uh, I support our Constitution. I do, too. I, I'm a big... Uh, I love... We're not domestic terrorists if we speak up. Did you I, know that? I love America. I think we're the greatest country. And, we're uh, getting screwed right now. But I think our... our I think our rights are like muscles, and uh, if you don't exercise them, they go away. And our First Amendment right is right now is is freedom of press, and it's also freedom of speech. People always say freedom of speech, but it's also freedom, freedom of press. press. Yes. And I have the right to be in public and take pictures and sure photographs, do. even if it makes somebody nervous or they don't like it or don't understand it. I'm 100 with you. And uh, so it really is just an exercise of rights. But really, the main reason I stopped is. Just to see if everybody was okay. Yeah. And, uh, yeah, I'm if a I, medic. I'm an EMT. And, and I'm not, but I'm I know how to former. dial 911. And it I'm looks a like, former EMT. Yeah. I saw them both get out. so I did. And I went up there and turned around, and I'm going to see if he needs. Yeah. So we're, we're just exercising our rights. Right. And, uh, and by the way, between you and me, I love Trump. <laughs> so I do too. I, I've been to his rallies. I was a witness. I was a witness. I was a witness. I was to the left as that car hit that one. I don't know if you need anything. Right under there as that car came around the corner and I got in the left hand lane and gunned it. 
and I and it would have hit me. Okay. And, uh, How you doing, officer? Appreciate your service to our yes, community. We, we support police. Thank just you so very you know, much. Not everybody, not everybody is against you. We support you and appreciate you serving our community. We would just ask, and I'll let you get back to work, we'd ask two oh. things of you. Yes, sir. Police your own. A cop's worst enemy is a bad cop. A good cop's worst enemy is a bad cop. I agree. So, number one. And number two, uphold the Constitution that you swore yes, an oath to. Yes, sir. Which, I, which yeah. takes in freedom of the press, right? It does, yes. So, More than happy to have it. I've been a police ride along in a few weeks. I I actually met uh, one of the officers the other day, and I w- put in my application a few oh, minutes ago. Oh, well, so. best of luck to I've, you. Yeah, they can do the background yeah, check. I've never been in trouble in my life. So. There you go. Well, best of luck to you. We appreciate yes, you, sir. Yes, sir. Absolutely. So. Good luck. Okay. No. I I stopped to make sure you were okay, ma'am. Yeah, I'm fine. Okay, I'm glad. That's why I stopped. Glad, Glad you're okay. Have a better day. Well, it looks like everybody's okay. That was the main concern. And um, we just wanted to make sure that everyone's okay. Looks like the the police officers are uh, handling themselves well and upholding our rights to take pictures and video in public and our First Amendment rights. We appreciate that. We appreciate Tulsa Police. If we have any Tulsa police officers or other police officers listening, just know that we support you. We appreciate you. We're not part of this crazy defund the police nonsense. Uh, In fact, we think that uh, you should have more funding and more training. And uh, we are behind you. We think that you do a noble job. And uh, we, uh, we appreciate good law enforcement. Um, we, we know that there's good law enforcement as well as bad law enforcement, but that, that's true of anything. That would be true of people taking pictures and video, uh, photographs or video. That would be true of doctors. That would be true of school teachers. But um, unfortunately, um, you guys have cameras on you everywhere you go, and the news media likes to highlight the uh, the negative um but but we're out highlighting we want to highlight the good officers like these two officers who were very cordial very professional and um so we want to highlight them and uh if we you know we actually we want it to be organic so whatever happens happens but if we run against if we run up against a uh, bad police officer a tyrant we will highlight them as well Uh, we want them exposed uh, we don't need them, um, and they they don't do they don't do any service for the ninety nine percent good police officers out there. So, uh, but we're really out here not to cause any issues, not to get in anyone's way, but really just to uh, exercise our First Amendment right, freedom of the press. That's the name of our channel, and. Uh, I like good police officers because police officers have a tough job. And like I said, unfortunately, if you watch the uh, legacy news, (laughs) 
uh, the big news channels, it, it's only it, most of the time. It's only when something negative happens that you. Um, it's only when something negative happens when you hear about a police officer. So. Hey, sir. Hey, thanks again for your professionalism. What is your name? Well, we'll go ahead and uh, wrap this one up. It looks like everybody's okay. Um, it looks like the police officers are good police officers out um, serving our community with excellence and we appreciate that and um, we will uh, we will call this a win for the uh, Tulsa Police Department until next time